I got law books. Hey folks, what's going on? Glad to see you back at the channel. Thanks for coming by. Today I've got another video that uh, you'll recognize the guy in it probably went viral. He got his Camaro towed because he doesn't like to use a license plate on it. Anyway, you probably remember from these clips here. Got his Camaro towed off. They had to use a, shoot, a screwdriver to shut it off because apparently he doesn't have a key to make it work. Uh, but anyway, yeah, he's back with another, another tyrant in this county. This is the County Watcher, I believe his channel is. And another tyrant gets, he gets confronted by another tyrant. This is before we get his Camaro towed. Let's watch the video. Okay, wait a minute. He isn't being confronted by a tyrant. He's confronting a tyrant. Apparently on a traffic stop where the officer pulls someone over, so he pulls up behind him and runs up on his car. Yeah, that, that's probably a good way to get notice. Oh, no, I'm just making sure you're following the law. You can continue. Oh, I can stay back, but... Just stay over there, okay? Because you're rolling up on me. I don't know who you are. Stand over there. I'm an auditor recording the situation. If you want to call back up to make sure I'm not going to do anything, that's fine. I understand that. I just got pulled over, so I'm making sure you're not following, you're not breaking the law like your other. Is this far enough, officer? How many, how many feet further back do you want me to step? All right, let's do it. Well, the auditor seems awful uh, compliant seeing it. He's, uh, you know in the grips of tyranny here in front of him. Uh, I don't understand why he's complying with all the officer's commands. This guy apparently, as he says, uh, knows the law. He knows how to hold the uh, officer accountable to make sure he doesn't break any. So he must be very familiar with all the laws in this particular county. I don't know, let's find out. Away from their vehicle, step over there. Step away from their vehicle. Is this a public area? Is this a public area? Is this a public parking lot? Wow, I hope he shows about 20 minutes of that car sitting there with its lights on. It's really fascinating footage. Jesus Christ, come on, do something. Jesus, question authority. Just find out what's going on there. And if you're in a public parking spot, or what are you, what are you doing? Hey man, I'm going to be chill with you, all right? But I'm going to ask you one last time. Please step back away from what I got going on. I'm going to remain close enough where I can at least hear the audio for the record no, because I am an audio. Step back like I've asked you to. How about I stand on the sidewalk over here where it's a public area? Right now, if you, if you, okay, right now, this is what I've got going on. You're interfering with my scene. I'm being as chill with you as I can. I'll go around and be on this public sidewalk for you. You need to stand over there. Get away from my unit. Officer, this is a public sidewalk. You're not on a public sidewalk. You parked on private property. This is a public sidewalk, officer. Hey, I don't know. This guy said he just got pulled over for something. He's auditing me. I don't know. I'm being chill with him. Just asking him to stay away from my traffic stop. I'm just trying to stay in a public area where I can record the situation. Because like you guys saw, I just got violated. So I'm just making sure he's not going to do anything crazy to this young woman. I went back and checked, and I did not see him being violated by anybody in the... He's not there to protect the young woman. Probably there to get her phone number or something like that so he can sneak over her house about 3 o'clock in the morning and go through a window. Yeah, I wouldn't trust this guy as far as I could throw him. What's the matter with him? Anyway, let's finish. Yeah, Is that you want to come over here? perfect? I just wanted, and I told him if he wants to call back up to make sure I'm not going to do anything crazy, 
have your guys watch me. Yeah. I'm just trying to record this situation yeah, yeah. because I just got violated, and I'm just trying to be a good citizen and make sure this guy. And I already told you I've been chill with you. I've been respectful when I asked you just to stay away from the traffic stop. Right. Truck, and you're walking up. You wanted you wanted me to go over here, officer. I wanted you, and what did you I, do? You walked up between both vehicles. I was going to go on the sidewalk. No, you're not. Not in the middle of my traffic stop. You're not. That is called interfering. I can arrest you for that. Officer, interference is public. It's a physical action. It's I'm not on an active traffic stop, which means I'm on an active investigation. We'll continue. I I can if I'm worried about what you're doing. And officer, you have five officers right here watching. I think he's a little heated. I think he needs to settle down, de-escalate. I know we were taught to de-escalate. It's just walking around the unit. Yeah, I think he's just a little... When you walk towards the driver's side where we're at, that's an um, issue with the RC. Well, now that there's four people here, I should be able to get closer where I can hear what's going on. That is a physical This line? That's a physical action. You're interfering with a traffic stop. Uh oh folks, it looks like we've got I double dare you situation going on here. It's a double dare, I can tell. It's not just a I dare you, it's a double dare. He just double dared him just across that line right there. What will he order to do? Will he continue to comply or will he be himself? According to this officer, if I pass this line, and this line goes all the way over there, if I pass this line, I'm going to jail. Apparently that was a lawful command. Apparently, these officers don't know that interference is a physical act. I'm just speaking. I'm just recording. I'm actually exercising the First Amendment right. It's a physical act. Am I walking, interfering? You stepping up is a physical act. Officer, respectfully, I'm recording. I'm just trying to get video, audio, video. We got one, two, three, four, five, six officers on scene to make sure that I'm not going to harm anybody after they just harmed me. I really got to start watching these videos before I edit them all the way to the end because I would have never done this one. This is just so boring. This guy is just an immature twat. Probably why he got his Camaro towed. Yeah, he, he purposely takes the license plate off his car so he can get stopped by the cops and tell them it's legal. He doesn't need it to travel and all that crap. The guy's a freaking idiot. Anyway, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to add a different video to this because that that just sucked. Anyway, let me see what I can find. Well, I think I found a video you might enjoy. This is a brand new auditor. He's been doing this since uh, September of 2023, so he's been around six or eight months or something in the yeah this is the only video he did he has like eight or ten videos and they're all really really bad he really can't film i don't know what he's using i think he's using an old phone to film with but it's real fuzzy uh the guy has no luck getting confrontations this one video he got in one almost confrontational little lady uh refusing to accept his FOIA request because that's not her job so let's check that one out. This is this is just fascinating. Why this guy get into this? I don't know. Anyway, what's up, guys? We're over here at the Boss Story of Police Department. Good to see if they respect our rights to record. Hopefully, they do good. Memorial Day's coming up. Got all those up there. I've cranked the volume up as high as it'll go and I still can barely hear the guy. We're going to speed ahead because absolutely nothing happens for the first 35 minutes in this video. He just walks around filming stuff. It's stupid. Uh, we'll get right to the, to the. Uh, I guess we could call it, yeah, here he is right here. He looks like a genius. Anyway, let's get right to the almost confrontation he got into. <laughs> Like a record? You know, just like a blank sheet of paper. And you, you, okay, you, well, let's do a request for a public record. Yeah. Okay, and uh, what are the ladies' names at the auditor's office? Okay. Yep. 
I didn't even go in there. I just aimed my camera just for one minute because I seen something cool on the wall. And she said, you can't record. And I said, it's a public lobby, ma'am. The, the police officer told me I could, which I know I can't. I know, but this is a public building. Yeah, but the onus is on you to protect others' privacy. Okay, so I would start the lawyer's <laughs> office then. Uh, well, you guys can't do it a copy. Any public place, you can fill it in, and the onus would be on to you. I, I, I can't hear you. you got to talk louder. I said, don't. You would have to give me a stamped copy, and then the onus would be on you to afford but it to the appropriate person. When you, when I gave the, you the information, the, this paperwork, you, if you're not, you're not complaining about someone in the police department and okay. you're not asking for records okay. in the police department. So I'm just going to shred these because they don't pertain to Well, us. I need the FOIA. Which one? This? Yeah. I'll go to the mayor's office and see what he says. Well, yeah, or that would be, you guys have to take it. It's a requirement, or you guys can get a lawsuit for that. What does it say at the top of that paper? I meant to put good citizen, but you don't have to put a name. All I need is the salaries, and I put my email. Okay. But they That's all you need. Form that you fill out. Okay. I'm just saying. Yeah, but for a complaint form, I mean, okay, I'll go to the mayor's office. Okay. This guy has a pretty dismal future in the uh, auditing business here because he really sucks at it. Goes to some small, tiny little town and expects them to know what the hell he's talking about. Nobody knows who you are. Nobody cares what you're doing. Go see the mayor. He probably won't talk to you anyway. Yeah, anyway, this is stupid. Anyway, that's all I got for you today, folks. Y'all have a fantastic day. Love y'all. Bye.